Okay, I'll just show you that this safe is operating correctly. It's, it's now open. Okay, so let's lock it up again. And now we're going to open it with a magnet. Okay, I'll just remove the I'll just remove the last of the three bolts or three screws rather off the back plate. Uh, so you can see what's going on inside and we'll we'll have a look at the solenoid here and put the magnet on the bottom and you'll see it retract the pin and it's that pin that is stopping the bolts from retracting. So how this works is electricity comes from the battery down here, activates a coil and pulls a plunger down that keeps this this locking mechanism locked. I'll just show you that by pressing the buttons on the other side of the door. Okay, so this is what would happen when I open it. See it move there, and then there. The when you close it, the pin comes back up. I'll do it again. I guess you didn't see it. There, you see the pin got pulled down. So that essentially is what the magnet is doing. Okay, I'll take the magnet and put it underneath the solenoid. There's a magnet there. I'm holding on to it because it's going to drag my hand <laughs> into metal. There, you see how it pulled the, pulled the plunger down. I'll do it once more. <sighs> Plungers up. Plungers down. So it can now be retract the bolts. Okay, so here it goes. Safe's locked up. And in here, I got a really strong magnet. It's uh, it's got a pull force of something like 380 pounds, something like that. But uh, I'm going to hold on to the safe and slide it on the bottom. This isn't something I want to have to repeat. All right, it's under there. And I don't know if you heard, but I heard the uh, solenoid get pulled down. And there it is, there it's open. But um, there's easier ways. I'll, I'll show you the easiest way. Because these magnets are dangerous. I've pinched my fingers and oh, they're really hard to get off. you got to slide them off to the corner. Yeah, easier ways. Okay, so my much preferred method of getting into a safe like this, as you can see it's locked. Underneath here is a lock and it's there to let you unlock and get into your safe if your battery dies. And use one of these little pick tool, especially I'll just reset it so I'm Picking it from scratch. Uh, nice little pick tool, ideal for this type of tubular lock. As you can see, it's locked. And just put it in there. Alright, just give it a little wiggle. And there you go. That's it. Open. Alright, thanks for watching and catch you later guys.